an issue, another case that is before the court that he's fighting, and that is a request by the Indian government to extradite him. Now, in the case of Dominica, the issue of extradition does not arise. It is an issue of a deportation because he's in the country illegally. He has no status in the country and therefore has no constitutional or legal protection. So, or legal prote protections. So, the Dominican government has a free hand to act. In fact, Mihal, Mihal Choksi may have made a mistake to travel to Dominica. Mm -hmm. Uh, the information that we're getting now is that he may have taken his girlfriend to Dominica, uh, probably to dinner to have a good time and so on, and got caught. Now, that would have been a monumental error because where is in Antigua? Because he's a citizen. We could not um, deport him. Now, the problem is if they deport him back to Antigua, then as a citizen, and even though his citizenship is unsettled, the reality is, you know, he still enjoys um, constitutional and legal protections as a citizen. We have no doubt that his citizenship ultimately will be revoked because he did not disclose certain material um, information. Antiguan Prime Minister has also confirmed that a private jet has landed on Dominican shores from India ahead of the extradition hearing slated next week. And we get you the inside scoop on India's legal strategy. Times now has learned that the legal representatives will be arguing for Choksi to be treated as an Indian fugitive, as according to them, his citizenship was never revoked. Team Choksi, however, accuses the Indian agencies of abducting their client from Antigua, a charge squarely rebutted by the documents and testimonies accessed by Times now. Sir, I just, sir, I just want to confirm the vessel, Lady Anna. The yacht has been booked by one Gurjeet Bhandal and one Gurmeet Singh. Can you confirm this, sir? Hi. The yacht was not booked by the, uh, the agency was not booked huh. by the yacht huh. prior to a run. Hmm. The agency was, once the yacht arrived in Dominica, hmm. the agency was asked to clear the yacht. Okay, the agency was asked to, so were there Indians on board and were, uh, was there Mehul Choksi on board? Can you confirm this? No, um, you're going to have to give us a call back if morning. Can you confirm these two packs named Gurjeet and Gurmeet, uh, Gurjeet Bandal and Gurmeet Singh? No, we cannot confirm at this time. Achha, I'll, okay, you want me to call you back again. And can you confirm the presence of Mehul Choksi on it? Okay. Okay. You said that your your company was involved. What was the role of your company? We were not involved in huh. anything to do with show. We were not involved in anything to do with show. You are not involved in. Okay. Okay. But was he on board? He was not in, on board, as far as we are aware. Okay. But that we have very limited information ourselves. Choksi's escape has created ripples even in Antiguan political circles. The opposition says his rights as a citizen are being violated. The Prime Minister insists all this support is incentivized by the aspirations for funding. It is hmm. not for Prime Minister to make a determination as to who hmm. should be sent back if it is in hmm. violation of the law and the constitution. Hmm. He has no hmm. right doing that. That's the first point. The second hmm. point is we have no connection, no affiliation mm. with Mr. Choksi. I have personally, mm. I've never met him. The party mm. has never had any contact with him. We're not mm. interested in his money. We carry no brief for Mr. Choksi. We do not believe that he should have been granted citizenship in the first place. But the fact is, he is a citizen. He is a citizen. And the rule of law, he is okay. a citizen. And he ought to be given all the rights of a citizen. All eyes are now on Caribbean courts to determine whether it will be extradition, deportation or back to square one for Mehul Choksi. Now, what we know is in Dominica, Dominica does not have any extradition treaty with India. Neither does Antigua and Barbuda. So 
while the courts are waiting to determine where to send Mahul Choksi, it's very interesting that Choksi is suggesting that he was kidnapped from Antigua and taken to Dominica. Mm. 